Well, hello, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for coming back to another edition of Tootcast Totally Organized Original Tutorials. So today I want to talk to you about one of the many stretching exercises for the computer user there are out there on the internet. And you know, there seems to be some really, really good programs out there. And one that caught my eye in particular was called Stretch Break. So I'm going to open up the program and I'm going to walk you through a couple of things that I think are extremely important for, for people when they're sitting in front of their computer. So it says you have 10 days left in your evaluations on stretch break. And if you want to email them, uh, the company is Para Technologies, and they're in Indiana Avenue, Costa Mesa, California. But their email is stretch at stretchbreak.com. So we'll just click OK there. Would you like to view the program icons options now? Sure, why not? So look at this. It's got, um, it, you know what? This is a fully featured program. You can select nine to five. You can select all of them. You can select none of them and make your own personal program by just going and selecting inadvertently. Um, but you know what I would suggest? I would go with 9 to 5. If, if you're in the office from 9 to 5, select that. And what it does is every 30 minutes, it reminds you to take a stretch break because that's extremely important. So up here, you've got, uh, you can adjust. It says no sounds during stretches. It, normally, the, the music is going to play. And you have some nice music, but we're going to click no sound during stretches and then show stretch now in the center. Okay. And you've got select messages. Well, let's just take a look at the select messages. Select messages. Let's, oh, look at this. They've got messages here that you can keep your wrists comfortable. These are reminders. You know, I really like this. One of them says, breathe deeply from your abdomen. We covered that also, or we're going to cover that in future shows. Um, keep your elbows close to your side. These are little reminders that you can put a personal touch to this program. It's very, very good. Avoid tucking the telephone between you or your ear and use a headset. You know what? We do an entire podcast. I think our first podcast touched on the importance of uh, getting a headset for yourself. So I really like these. Look, I should intersect with the top third of the viewable screen area on the monitors. Look at all these reminders that you can have. Center le letter portion of the keyboard with monitor. These are great reminders. When you're thinking, not typing, rest your hands in your lap. Uh, use a light touch and float wrists while typing. This is very, very good. I, I really enjoy these, all of these suggestions. So it's got, uh, how many suggestions in total? 21 suggestions in total. So we're just going to cancel out of there so you know that they have suggestions. And then you can select the stretches. Look at all the stretches here. So you can personalize it for whatever you feel, the areas of your body. Um, for example, eyes around the clock. If you get eye strain, you can use this. If you get um, arms, arm uh, pain in the arms, if you get pains in the back, this is a back arch. If you have an, uh, bad elbows, you can do a belt. You know what? This looks like a really good program. Look at all that. Stretch the back. Big, wide, yawn. Oh, my goodness. Thumbs across palm. So what we'll do is we'll just, uh, we've stored the defaults. Okay. And we'll cancel out of there. And we'll just click OK and see what next happens. So the default is for 30 minutes here. They're going to remind us. Now, look at this. It says, start with the palms facing in and arms extended forward and fingers interlocked. Twist hands inward and continue until palms are facing out and arms are again extended forward. As you do the stretch, breathe slowly in through the nose and out through the mouth. And you've even got ergo hints here. Look at this. Ergo hints. The information on this file is a summary, generally accepted information on ergonomics and may vary depending on, yada, 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 yada. So we've got workstation set up. Oh, this is good. The chair, the feet, the elbows, the wrists, the head and neck, monitor height, and monitor distance. You know, I think I may just have to buy this program. It tells you about the chair, too uh, little curvature and too much curvature. It tells you about your posture. You know, we really need... Uh, information like this and uh, programs like this. Input devices. 
Talks about your keyboard, the monitor, the mouse, uh, trackboards, trackballs, visual, lighting, multiple workstations, and how to contact us. This is very, very good. So how about if we go through there? Okay, we'll set that down. All right. So back arch. So she's got a back arch there. And let's go to uh, see what the next stretch is. Moses the yawn, breathe in deeply through your nose. With your mouth closed, breathe out slowly through your mouth. Neat. And flex wrist forward. Let's take a look at some of the options that this has. Huh? Again, it just takes us back to this customizable option page, which is good. Okay, and let's go to the next stretch. Elbow pull. Place palm of right side on opposite shoulder with left hand grasp right elbow and push, push gently. Repeat on other side. Inhale as you push your elbow and exhale as you lower your arm. Great. And they've got a lot of stretches here. Hands over eyes. Oh, this is a good one. This is a very good one. Let's go another one. Please stand up for the next stretch. Okay, look at that. Step forward on one foot, keeping the other foot in place. Bend knee of forward foot and shift weight to it, returning to starting position. Repeat with the other foot. Now, I don't know how many of you are going to actually have time to stand up in front of your computer monitor, so you may want to follow all the ones that are seated. You could probably do the ones that stand up on your coffee break, because, and then you might want to clump all the ones that are standing up on your coffee break and the ones that are seated during your uh, time when you're seated at your computer terminal. But I really like all of the stretches they've got here. Look at this. Fully extend all fingers, then curl them in the first two joints. This stretch is not intended to replace professional medical care, nor contradict medical advice you may have received. If you are experiencing consistent physical discomfort, consult your physician. Place finger on chin and relax the neck. Move head back so the chin tucks in. Allow head to move to starting position. Hmm. So again, we'll go back to options. Now, what we'll do is we'll go to end this session. What happens if we open it up again? Ah, okay. Okay, so temple massage for people to get headaches. Thumb stretch. Oh, that's an important one. Please stand up for the next one. Evaluation, raise arms to side, then up over your head, return to the starting position. Inhale through your nose as you lift your arms and exhale through your mouth as you lower your arms. Again, please sit. See, you know, it, this looks like a very, very good program. Hands to floor. And what this does, what they're, what they're trying to do, I would assume, is work your entire body throughout the course of the eight-hour day or, or nine-hour day or 12-hour day <laughs> if you're a workaholic. Because when we sit at a computer terminal, we do not get the exercise that we should finish. Next stretch in 27 minutes. And there's the ergo reminder. Wow, I like it. I really, really enjoy it. Oops, come back here. Stretch break. Okay, it's, it's running in the corner here. 27 minutes. Okay, so you know what? I like this. I really, really, really like this. Ergo hints again. There's your ergo hints. Options. Okay. Well, you know, I think this is a great program. And the, it comes with a free 10-day evaluation. And I would, uh, if I were you, I, give it a try. And I'll put the, the address where you can get it at the end of this little video blurb. But I think it's a, it's a program well worth taking a look at. So this is uh, Rick Holland for Healthy Tech Talk. The, give this one a try and give us a, some feedback uh, on what you find, if it works for you, if it doesn't. Um, our email address is healthytechtalk at gmail.com. Thanks so much for joining us, everyone. We'll talk to you later. Bye-bye. Take care.